Hello guys, peace of the Lord with everybody. I'm sure many now they are wondering like what's wrong with this guy? Why he is putting this ugly picture in the front of us? A fly? Come on. Well, what I can do? Because I'm going to talk about the fly. You know, the Prophet of Islam, his knowledge is behind our mind you know as long Muslims are talking about miracles and they are talking about uh, science discovery and they are talking about how amazing is the God of Islam and his prophet Muhammad because supposedly he is the messenger who delivered the Quran for us you know I thought maybe it's a good idea to give some people you know our people a uh, uh, some knowledge about the medication of the Prophet like what kind of medication he used to teach he's a, you know the, the, the Prophet he was acting as a doctor you know he's a doctor who never did recovery to anyone you know and I can show you a hadith about he caused death of people who he did advise them to take medication like there is a woman uh, her husband he have a sugar problem in his blood so you know, today we solve the problem. Problem, you know, by insulin. Muhammad he told her, give him honey. The woman, she went, she came back after two days. She said he's getting more sick. He is, his body is shaking now. He said, give him. I told you, give him honey. She said, I did. He said, do it again. So she did, give him more honey. The woman, after a few days, she came and she said, the pro, you know, that my husband, prophet, my husband, he cannot see anymore. He lost his vision. The Prophet, he insists and he got angry. He said, I told you, give him honey. And she said, I did. He said, gave him again. So she gave him again. And after that, she never showed up. So Muhammad, he sent one of his men because he used to take wages for his, for this. He acted as a doctor and he charged money, not for free. Advice to death, you know, and he charged you. So she came back after, you know, uh, he sent somebody. She never came back. So he sent somebody to check on her. And when the man he went to that woman he asked her the prophet he sent me to see why you didn't show up anymore she said well there is no need because my husband is dead now he killed him this guy he have a sugar problem in his blood and he keeps saying to her give him honey give him honey give him honey the man is dead now let us see different kind of honey the prophet of Islam is talking about Muhammad one day he was eating and when he was eating, a fly fell down in the soup, in his dish. Everybody was watching. The fly is, you know, swimming inside the soup, trying to escape. And the prophet, he is just eating. Like, you know, it's in the front of his eyes. He is looking at the dish, and he is eating. It's a soup. You know, you have to get the soup close to your mouth. You know, because at that time, there is no spoon. So you are, you know, he is using the, 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 the pot, you know, to drink from it. So the, the, the fly is in the front of his eye, in the front of his nose. It's not something he didn't see. And people, they start like looking, what this guy is doing? Like, you know, they said, prophet, don't you see this fly? He said, oh, I forgot to tell you. You know, if a fly fell down in your soup, just push it down, all down inside and swallow it. Because the right wing have a medication and the left wing have a poison. You believe it? Now, maybe I know Muslims will say, this is a lie, this is not a true, you are a liar, you, you know, I know the story. Here we go. This is the official government website of Saudi Arabia. The Kingdom of Saudi Arabia, Ministry of Islam and Guidance. And as we said, you can go there. Okay. This is Sahih al-Bukhari, the book of Sahih al-Bukhari. This is Hadith number 5336. 5336. The book of Sahih al-Bukhari, the book of medicine. The chapter name, If a fly fell down in your dish. If a fly fell down in your dish. This is the name of the chapter. So, it says, 
أن رسول الله صلى الله عليه وسلم قال إذا وقع الذباب في إناء أحدكم فليغمسه كله ثم ليطرحه فإن في أحد جناحيه شفاء وفي الآخر دواء So if you know a fly fell down in your dish push all the fly inside you know for me if a fly fell down in this in the dish and it's a soup you know imagine it's a soup okay because he's saying in the explanation that this is hisa so if if it's fell down in the soup you know I will not be really able to eat from it because it's going to be disgusting you know I might eat it if there is no way like I'm dying from hunger and I am in the desert and you know what a fly fell down you know I cannot I cannot solve the problem because there is no choice but if I am in my home as the prophet he was and the fly fell down why he is drinking the soup so the solution is because people they saw him around him he is doing that he is not getting disgusted from the, 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 the fly he said to them you push the fly all of it inside the soup so instead of taking it out right away no he's saying push it all the way inside okay and he said after that throw it I don't know he threw it out or he threw it in the soup I'm not sure because in here it says I don't know what he mean exactly let us say he is saying he threw it outside so not to assume he is swallowing it you know because really it's going to be really disgusting to see the prophet is swallowing swallowing the, the the fly so let us let us take it as he's saying throw it away okay I think this is better uh, understanding for the hadith so he's saying and this is the problem now the reason he is asking you to push the fly inside the soup down because he's saying because one of the wings have medication and the other one have disease now where is the disease and where is the medication it's one of the wings have disease and the other wing have medication so one of them have a medication and the other one have a disease have a sickness now guys I know Muslims are smart and I know they will say to me you are stupid because you know I have to because I don't, I don't understand their profit you have to be stupid you know for Muslims if you don't accept Islam you are stupid for sure so let us say I am a stupid you are smart how you can explain to me a prophet of God saying that the wings one wing have medication and the other wing have disease number one we can go and search about a fly if you search about a fly you will see the most clean part of the fly is the wings anybody know why? No, why? do you have an idea why? because wings when the fly move fly the wings they move thousands of time in a second thousands which will make all kind of dirt go away the dirt of the fly according to science it's not the fly itself not the wings it is what is going to be attached to the hair of the legs of the fly so when the Prophet of Islam he said one of the wings have medication and the other wings have disease we don't know which one you know first there is a difference between the wing in the right and the wing in the left how this one let us say the one in the right have medication the one in the left have disease what is the difference between the one in the right and the one in the left only stupid people will believe that the right wing is different from the left wing you know and wings of uh, of uh, 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 of a fly they are the same as all insect wings almost they are made from ketene and they are not uh, 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 really they, they don't have anything it's it's a, it's a dead material it's a dead material like your nails so where is the disease will be and where is the medication will be I want a Muslim to explain to me about this holy 
uh, uh, fly if we can't call it holy because if the fly have a medication you know I advise Muslims uh, to eat the wing the one have medication like you know I, I would like to see a, a, a new uh, manufacturer it's called uh, islamcofly.com you know fly the Prophet is advising you to uh, swallow and eat flies or put the fly in the soup I, I don't know this is Muhammad this is his teaching either you take it or you leave it it's up to you Muslims thank you all Jesus is Lord Islam is false and no Muslim can answer me you can cry in your text but you cannot answer me thank you very much